The world has had the privilege of witnessing her brilliant artistry for over 40 years. From television to film to her live no cuts or edits award-winning Broadway performances. Through her, we experience fully realized multi-dimensional characters. Characters full of love, joy, honesty, and most importantly, humanity. Having the pleasure of knowing her personally, I can tell you to create these characters we adore, she simply brings herself to the roles. Felicia Rashad encompasses all the aforementioned adjectives and so much more, which is why the work audience have seen over her illustrious and still blooming career pales in comparison to the work she does off stage and off camera. Many are just artists, but the special ones are artists with intention and purpose. Their imaginations extend beyond the stories in a script. There is an understanding within and even a demand that their art and their platforms achieve the greater purpose of moving humanity forward. Tonight, the Creative Coalition honors Felicia Rashad, an activist who uses her profound artistry and strategic skills to draw attention to the remarkable stories of African-American achievement. For her commitment to diversifying the stories of American history through African-American Cultural Heritage Action Fund. As co-chair of the fund, Felicia Rashad's outspoken leadership and thoughtful compassion ensures that like her characters, the world will know an African-American culture that is not just multidimensional, but a fully realized representation, thus truthfully displaying our nation's history. She is a reminder that what we do as artists creates a resume, but what we do as people creates a legacy. It is an honor and a true privilege to present the Creative Coalition's Humanitarian Award to Felicia Rashad. Thank you, Jason. Thank you so much. I am honored by this recognition for my work with the National Historic Trusts African American Cultural History Action Fund. Feeling like I grew up knee deep in history, the importance, the value, and the necessity of this great work has never been lost to me. Historic preservation honors the past, yes, but it also gives context to the way we live today. How do I know all this? Well, my mother, <laughs> my mother, my mother attended Brainerd Institute, a school in Chester, South Carolina that her parents attended and her grandparents attended. And today the site of this school is on the registry of historical sites in the state of South Carolina. And as she remembers and recalls her time at Brainerd, every memory is laced with poetry, literature, music, art. This is no, there's no doubt that this influenced uh, the beginnings of her career as a poet and cultural uh, arts activist, which undoubtedly influenced the way she reared her children, making sure that we had instruction in music, in theater, in dance, and in visual arts, with the understanding that creative thought and expression are fundamental to human development and of great service to humanity. So I thank the Creative Coalition for using the platform and the power of entertainment industry to ensure that arts flourish in communities and in public schools. And I also thank the Creative Coalition for honoring and supporting television talent and leaders in the industry who use their voice. Many things you do is teach and help guide young talent. And Chadwick Boseman was one of your students. What do you think legacy will be and how will he continue to inspire young people, especially young black men? I think his legacy will be the importance of purpose, finding one's purpose and, and living in that truth. And I think, I think we will see his name and image in many places other than uh, film. I think so. I think he will inspire people to study 
because he was a very studious actor. And I think you will inspire people to, to really grab hold of their dreams and to live them out and make them reality. That's beautiful. You're also going to be, I can't wait to see this, in between the world and me with actors such as Oprah Winfrey, Angela Bassett. Has production begun and how are they, how are producers keeping everyone safe during the pandemic? They're following very strict, very strict codes. And uh, I felt very safe on that set and it was a pleasure to be there. Fantastic. Congratulations. Thank you so much for being here tonight. Thank you.